For the past six months, the world of Pet Simulator has been quiet. No updates, no videos, and no hints of a new game, with the exception of a number nine being tweeted over and over again. Everyone had speculations, and most of those speculations were wrong. Amidst all the controversy, something was brewing, and like a phoenix rising from the ashes, a new game is coming. Today we react to this new game trailer and give our thoughts on everything. Will this game be the next big game on Roblox, or will it fade like some in the past have? Let's find out. Oh! oh man. Okay. 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 It's the, it's the little guy. He's so happy. Oh wait, dude. Okay. All right. First. First. What the heck, dude? First impressions. It kind of looks the same. In fact, it looks like it's just an update of the last game. All right, you know, you got your coins, you got your stuff here, buy next area, equip more pets. There's the inventory. Good God, look at all those eggs. <laughs> what the heck? Okay, we can claim a hoverboard. All right, all right, yep. Free potions. Okay, that looks cool. Wait, what was that? I'm gonna watch everything all at once and then we'll go back and we'll pick everything apart. This is all the same. It's all the same. Like there is new things, but it looks like a huge, what? You can swim now? Whoa, that's actually really cool. I was, I've made so many jokes about wanting to swim in the Axolotl ocean. And now it actually is true. Look at all the fish. Oh my God. That looks insanely cool. Did the, did the camera just fall on my guy? What the heck happened? All right, machine eggs. Dude, there's so much stuff happening. There's a mantis shrimp. Okay, golden pets. All right, so the gold machine is back. It looks like you, it looks like just one massive area. There's fishing. Okay, the fuse machine's back. Now we're playing mining simulator. <laughs> what is this? There's the Tokyo world or the Kauai world again. We got an obby. Dude, what the heck am I watching? Oh, it's, it's Queen Tabitha. Yo, okay, all right, all right. I, I do love the aesthetic. What is all that stuff? Oh my gosh. Okay, okay, okay. This actually looks really sick. It really does. I, I'm really excited. There's so much stuff in this game. It looks like they've been very, very busy. Enchants. Oh my god! <laughs> they just did, they just opened like 80 eggs at once? What? Okay, alright. Dude, how oh my gosh. Okay, looks like there's a winter world. See, it looks like a whole bunch of worlds that you just kinda hop to, which is cool. There are rebirths. I'm not happy. There there are rebirths. Bro, I don't want to do rebirth. December 1st. There it is. December 1st, 2023. Okay. All right. That means that this website right here that has been making the rounds is the actual true website from big games. Pet Simulator 99 drops in 12 days, one hour and 54 minutes, which uh, is at Friday, December 1st at noon eastern standard time 11 like it would update it used to the same days that it would update except for like the same time it would update just on friday instead of saturday i don't know if that's just for this game or if that's going to be their idea going forward where they always update on fridays we'll see i don't even know if it's going to be like a weekly update situation because that was a lot it's a copy and paste from the different games it is kind of copy paste I i'll give it to you but I, I don't know, man. All right, let's see if I can go back. Let's see if we can, like, do a deep dive to figure out what happened. Because there are a lot of good things, but there are also a lot of bad things. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Okay. All right. Let's see. A lot of people are saying they're not impressed. It's uh, just a bad remake. Oh, boy. Yeah. Yeah. Like I said, I wasn't overly impressed in first. There's a lot of like mechanics and game updates. Good gosh. How long? Look at this. Look how long the premiere is. The premiere is just as long as the trailer. Okay. All right. So we're going to do a deep dive. We're going to do this. It looks as far as like the world goes. 
I'm not sure how I feel. Like, it's such a small area. It looks like... It looks like like little cubes of like this big massive world and you only have access to like little cubicle corners that you just kind of have to I, I I don't know. It, it's it, I'm not sh I, I don't I don't like this part so much. This is not really impressive. Uh looks like there is a like counter. Did you see that? Hold on. Right there in the corner. It says rewards drop every 1000 likes. So, uh I don't know if you guys remember this or not. Back about I guess it was 2021, maybe like August. No, August of 2022, right when the game was kind of stopped updating for the first time. Uh, Pet Simulator, <laughs> big games. They like withheld the update until the game reached 3 million likes. And as we can see, bro, it's still 3 million likes. Like nobody liked the game past that point, but it took forever for them to update it. So it looks like the new incentive that people are doing is like every time you like the game, uh, rewards drop. So I don't know. That might be cool. That might not be cool. Let's see what else we got here. Yeah, this part is just very basic. This part is just basically pet simulator again. I mean, at its core, this is exactly what you can expect. I I, I don't expect them to change a whole lot. Um, obviously you, you do, you grind coins, you use those coins to unlock the area instead of it just unlocking. Now it does this cool animation where it kind of blows up, which is kind of cool. All right. Look at how many eggs. <laughs> That's insane. <laughs> that is going to be just a mess. I, can you imagine like looking for a specific egg and it's in all of this? Like that's. I'm not a huge, huge fan of that. I, I, I liked I liked the separation, like every world has its own egg. I, I'm not a, maybe like on if you did that at the spawn where you had all the eggs at once, but then each world still had like the eggs for their section, I think that would be cool. This wasn't worth waking up at 2 a.m. for. Oh, man. Yeah. It, I think the trailer is probably a little bit hyped up more than it should have been just because, like, the game has not updated in so long, and there's, like, eight, nine people streaming the up the trailer. And, yeah, like, that was it. That was it. So, uh, as far as, the, like, what is this? What is that? That's what I want to know. It says owned, but, like, what is this? Oh, it's like a walk speed. It's like an upgrade. Is it permanent or just like for for like one time? Like you get like a little bit of reward and then you can use it and then it fades out and then you don't have it anymore. Like that's that's what I want to know. Is that a pay to win thing or is that like a grind to win? Do you have to actually play to actually get that? So uh, that's interesting. All right, we got free diamonds. That's kind of same. Okay, what is this? This is like an equip more pet machine. So it looks like you can increase the size of your pet team and you can have 99, <laughs> 99 pets, 99. That's insane. You can get a 15 more pet head start for zero Robux. That probably will change. Uh, but yeah, you, you looks like you buy plus one pet equips with diamonds, which is kind of cool. Um, so that means like that's a reason to like save up diamonds and stuff. That's okay. That's not bad. Instead of like, you know, equipping and indexing pets, because that's what you did before you index pets to be able to equip more pets. Uh, you can also only get the 23, not 99. So that's definitely different. Uh, all right. So this is the inventory. It looks like you can put different. Can you put different enchants? just on the pets themselves like can you buy the books and instead of having to roll for the enchant can you just specifically buy the enchant take them and put them on the pet you want to put it on and the other question is can you take those enchants off when those pets become obsolete and put them on new pets so if you have this really amazing enchant once you put it on a pet can you take it off the pet again that's what i want to know but that that's kind of cool i actually like that Dude, these that that this is insane. Look at that's so insane. <laughs>
Okay, looks like that. All right, you can buy random enchants. Okay, so I think that's what's doing. Instead of in doing an enchant machine, you can actually buy the enchants straight up and put them on the pets you want. I, I like that. I, it's kind of the same as like what you would expect because it does still have a randomness to it, but it's different. And like I said, it, it would be really cool to just buy the book and put it on in different pets. I don't know if that's going to be the thing. Part of me thinks that that's not. Once you put it on a pet, it's stuck on that pet. But, you know, here's to hoping. Honestly, the game is mid. Yeah. Uh, like I said, I, I think... I think the hype surrounding this game does not meet how long we had to wait for it. I, I actually like that. There's a lot of cool things with this. I actually am excited for the update for the updated game to come out. Um, but you're right. It is. It is for the amount of time they spent working on it. It's not kind of meeting too much time has passed. If this draw, if this update dropped in the summer, yeah, everybody would be on this game. I, I think that's the difference. Okay, so it combined into better potions. So you can now combine potions, which is cool. All right, not bad. We also got some free potions that you can claim. Okay. The tree looks kind of cool. This looks kind of cool. I, I, I don't know if you can, like, go in that tree and, like, do things inside there. Maybe they'll do, like, events in that as well. Uh, it looks like the coins are still the same for this area, though. Here's the more pet equips again, buying with more diamonds. There we go. The next area looks like we've unlocked. Here's some loot, and you can see that you can now feed your pet as well. I don't know what that does. I don't know what that means. I don't know if that means they're going to be leveled up to where that pet you have is going to be even stronger because it's like a level 99. Kind of like, I don't know if you've seen Arm Wrestling Simulator, but Arm Wrestling Simulator, you can feed the pets. The pets get higher levels, they get stronger, and they're more powerful. Maybe, maybe that's what it is. And it's like a permanent upgrade. You don't have to keep feeding them. Did you see that? Hold on. What was that uh, What was that transmission animation? What is that? It's like a dragon. It says, make a video partner with us. <laughs> okay. All right. The obby thing looks cool. I know a lot of people wanted the obbies in the games and stuff, which is actually really cool. I, I'm really, uh, I'm really excited for like the obby situation where you can like, you have to beat the obby to get a pet. Maybe you have to do it at a certain time to get a pet before the, like the limited quantity, which would be cool. Danger falling rocks take cover. Oh my God. Okay. So we Indiana Jones in it. All right. And then there's this. <laughs> okay. Yeah, and then you go to the end, you get rewards. Okay, that I, that's kind of cool. We've said for years that we wanted like an obby or something in the game, and they finally added it in. Okay, so here's another area. It looks like the big breakable chests are back. Hatch thirty five your bed. It looks like the uh, there are quests. I don't. You can see over here on the side. Use two tier one potions. Break seventy five gifts. This right here is basically like the the summer update where you had like these quests you got different rewards it looks like they are bringing that back as well the swimming thing is cool i don't care who you are the swimming thing is awesome also yo what's up cutie beans thank you so much for the uh the looks like a 10 month you've been a member for 10 months insane shout out to you all right let's let's dude i love absolutely love the swimming i know it's so gimmicky and it's like not that cool but like i love it i think it's awesome all right let's see we got uh we, we got this we got this this is a hasty flag place in an area to supercharge pets last five minutes looks like there's like flags that's new where you like put it down and you like get really op as long as you're in that one little area. I don't know. I don't know why you wouldn't just make it like server wide. That way the flag would follow you wherever you go. Maybe that's to make it a little bit more strategic. It is what it is. Either way, that's what you get. That's new. All right. What else we got? We got a coin jar event, which it looks like the coin jar, the jar drops and you break coins to make the coins go in the jar. And then do you get, wait, is that rewards for it? Hold on. Oh my God. I keep clicking where I need to go. And then there, okay. 
Let's see. Okay, this is not the same. This looks like the rookie level rank rewards where you break these things right here over to the side, the quest, and you get this stuff for the rewards. Okay, so that doesn't explain what the coin jar is for. Dude, I love swimming with the fishes. I think that's so freaking cool. <laughs> I, I also don't understand the random cannon that drops. Like, if you want to teleport, you just a cannon just drops on you, and then you... uh. You get yeeted pretty much to another area that's just like right there. I don't know, man. I I, I think I I like the world. I like how they differ. Like you would go to a different world altogether. I don't like how it's just like little blocks that you kind of just go to. Not a fan of that, but it is what it is. We got the egg machine. You can open eggs. I don't know what this is for either just yet. Whoa, 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 okay, that's the buying another. Look how many, one, two, three. That's eight, nine, 10, 11. I think there was a, hold on, can I, let's see if I can, let's see if I can figure, it goes really fast. Let me see if I can do this real quick, hold on. There it is. Okay, so, hold on, that's not it. Oh, it happened so fast, I can't do it. It looks like there's a one, a three, an eight, and an 11 option now. So you'll probably have to pay to win to get the last one, the 11 option. Okay. It says you can only transfer five huges. Are you serious? No way. Wait, wait, wait. Go to the main game. You can, okay, we're going we're gonna to pet some transfer update. Okay, we're going to go check out the update here in just a second. I'm like deep diving this. We got about a minute left in the video. Gold pets, you know, that's pretty, pretty just regular, same, nothing. The fishing is cool. Look at this. And you actually, there's skill involved. You have to keep tapping the bobber with the bar. So you have to keep tapping it to like keep it in this area to get the fish. Okay, not bad. There's fused pets. Looks like a little fun things you can climb up and down on. Mining simulator, which is weird. It looks like there's some other different areas. Okay, I am starting to see. Look at that. Look, look. Now you can start seeing. These are vaults and safes, and they're covered in, like, the cherry blossoms and lanterns, uh, which is very Japanese. So, like, yeah, that's... They are starting to be themed. I don't know if you have to, like, go to a different world or if it's all just later on in the massive cube chunks of everything. Looks like we got an obby again. This is very basic obby, unlocking of doors. Okay, all right, there's a spinny wheel. What is that? You have to spin wheels. There's keys that you're gonna have to find. There's voting booths, whatever that is. <laughs> VIP rewards. Okay, that's, that's pretty normal. Okay, look at the inventory, dude. This inventory looks like a nightmare. Why, why would I want to have everything all at once? You got a shovel, you got the fishing pole, you got a ball, you got snacks, you got the jar, you got the flags, you got the keys, TNT, bro, what, you got key fragments, so you don't even get the whole key, you just get fragments, and you got to put them together. Oh my god, dude, this game is so grindy already, I'm already overwhelmed. <laughs> There's a magnet flag. Okay, all right, so everything's... It looks like you can get like little, little pay to win game pass things just for like the flags or something just for that area. Here's the jar thing again. Looks like a uh, comet shower you can activate. Here's the inventory with all the different like enchants and stuff. Equip more pets again. Was what did he was he taking them off or adding them? No, I think he was just adding. Them. Okay, there's the index. Looks like the index has come back. And you have enchantment index, hoverboard index, booth index, and pet index. The enchant index is weird. Okay, anyway. Oh my god. Okay, it was an 11. <laughs> there's way more. What is that? There we go. By 70. <laughs> what the heck? Buy 70, buy 70. That's insane. You think it's less pay to win than before? Like I said, there, there's a lot of things. I can see where the pay to win will come in. 
obviously that's not being showcased in this i i probably you can buy a game pass where you can you know you maybe have to buy a game pass where you have to unlock all these you know maybe it's maybe like if you don't buy the game pass you only have the buy one the buy three the buy eight option instead of the buy one the buy 35 the buy 70 option i don't know there it looks not pay to win it looks it kind of does look still pay to win but it looks like it could potentially be a little bit more free to play but i don't know man it, there's there's a lot of things that not have been discussed in this okay i love how everything decreased to just the four different ones that's cool i like that i always found that a little annoying to get like 500 of the same pet okay here's the uh here's the trade mission here's the trade looks like you can trade can you trade hoverboards Wait, okay, these are all pets. These are huge pets, obviously. There's a new Titanic right there. It looks like a fire gecko looking thing. Or maybe a fire lava dragon or something. I don't know what that is, but it's a new Titanic of some sort. Okay. Here's the new trading plaza. There's the new Titanic again. Looks like the Chinese dragon is what it looks like. I love that this little area right here has the gondola. Maybe that's like something you can ride to like a top of the mountain, which is kind of cool. Yeah, I just, I'm not a fan of this massive world. That's the same world. It's just like a whole bunch of different little areas. Like, I don't know. It seems like that's a way you can just like cheat your way. If you can find little exploits to go from being between the worlds and stuff. Nevertheless, I hate this. I hate if there's one thing I hate, it's rebirths. I've, I've said it for literal years. The fact that there is a rebirth, coins in areas will reset. You keep everything else. All right, travel anywhere, portable canda or cannon. We got a castle key, access to trading plaza, spinny wheel, and more. Pets are seventy five percent stronger permanently. I, I like, yeah, but like, how many rebirths do you have to do? Is this a game where you're going to have to spend your first five months rebirthing every five seconds to finally get done with that so you can focus on the game itself? Like, dude, the rebirths are such a cop-out. I hate, hate, hate rebirths. And I was so happy that Pet Simulator did not do rebirths. And now they have. That's like my one, and that's a big complaint. Like I hate reverse like so much. It, it's such a turn off on the game. And maybe it's like, maybe you just have to do it like five times and you're done. But if it's a situation where you have to rebirth like a hundred times, I'm not doing it. Like, I'm just not, I, I, I can't. Okay. You get, you do get rewards though, which is kind of cool. It's like, is that a free Titanic? Are we getting a free golden Titanic? <laughs> <laughs> is that what's happening and the final thing pet simulator x or pet simulator 99 it's gonna get very hard to get used to saying pet sim 99 yep oh <laughs> what's happened what i leave the game for like three seconds nick okay it was like 10 minutes but like i left the game for a while and oh my god <laughs> i come back to this transfer pets and eggs to pet simulator 99 oh boy send items to pet simulator 99 do i want to do this do i want to do why do i feel like why do i feel like once i do this i can't do it anymore all right i'm gonna can i can i send one and then come back and do more later ready to transfer history you have no history all right let's see what we got we got huges I can only select five. Wait. No way. Five? You can only. There are no exclusive pets. Okay, so you can transfer exclusive pets. I was worried that you couldn't. You can transfer a Titanic. You can only transfer one Titanic? Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh my God, dude. All right, I, like I said, man, I had like over a thousand huges and I didn't want to keep a thousand huges, but like I definitely wanted to keep all of my Titanics. <laughs> oh, no, man. Oh, no, new game's much better. I, I definitely think they're going to work out a lot of the kinks. I like I feel like a lot of the things that made Pet Simulator X bad 
uh, the diamond mine. I didn't see a new diamond mine. I'm actually really happy about that because the diamond mine is what killed the economy it, and like people exploited it uh, with all the like the exploits that kept happening and you had to turn around and fix it. Yeah, that that was really bad. Okay. All right. Nick's screaming at me. He's telling me to read the DMs. Uh, okay. Let's see what's going on. Nick, what did you send me? This is the smallest screenshot I've ever seen in my life. This is what Nick sent me. What is this, Nick? Preston, I am recording for trailer. Leave. I kill you. Wait. What? Why did you send me that? <laughs> Why are you screaming at me to tell me that was it? Night Fox, use alt accounts. Use alt accounts to transfer more. That's a good idea. It is a good idea, but the same, but the problem is, bro, I need like 500. I I need like 500 things. Okay, read that. Wait, hold on. I, I, like, I don't have 500 accounts. Okay, read the FAQs. Okay, what is this? Pet Simulator X no, to Pet Simulator 99 transfer. What can I transfer? Exclusive pet, huges. Do I lose my pets here? Nope. Oh, you don't lose your pets here. So like, then you have it in both games. That's not bad. Uh, what happens if I trans? Okay, pets are marked in Pet Simex as transferred. Can I transfer eggs? Unlike pets, eggs will move permanently. There is a weekly limit per category. Okay, so it's a weekly limit. That's all right. That's not bad. I, I'll take the weekly limit. I, it, it means I can still like eventually transfer all of my Titanics. I just have to wait like. 30 weeks you know it is what it is and i can have alt accounts when is the game coming out check the countdown how long do i have this will be disabled after six months which pets can you transfer okay so pets tied to merch and exclusive shop so that means every pet that you bought in the exclusive shop or the uh the merch which is basically every huge and non-huge uh pet as well as the titanic secure so serious transfer yes do enchants transfer? No, it's a new system. Interesting. Signatures transfer. Nicknames do not. Can you bring the eggs back? No. Uh, is there a limit? The pet box can only hold 250 at a time. What does that mean? Because I have a thousand huge pets. <laughs> Can I still trade pets in both games? This is really interesting. Is this available on, you can do it, you can begin now. I think it actually makes sense to begin now because like, like I said, if there's a weekly limit, uh, then I'm only gonna have five available. All right, let's do this. Let's let's transfer some, let's transfer Gerald. Let's transfer one of these Kawaii dragons. Let's transfer this huge Dominus. Um, Definitely a cool cat. One more, one more, one more. What we did, one more. What we got here, what we got? Put some, get some huges on the stream. I will, obviously. We're going to do that. Uh, let's see. Huge arcade cat. Do I want to do that one? I think I do. I think we're going to do the huge arcade cat. There we go. Got the five selected. We're going to transfer them. You will still keep these pets in Pet Simulator X. They've been transferred. I've got five huge pets already in the new game. <laughs> let's do a Titanic. Uh, which one do I want to do? Let's see. Let's see. Which one? Which one? Which one? Let's do, let's do, uh, let's just do, let's do one of these basic ones. Let's do the Titanic hologram. Yeah, yeah, let's do that one. Okay, transfer. You'll keep it, but it's still there. There, it's been transferred as well. So now that it's been taken off, I can do 10 exclusive pets. I don't think I have 10 pets. I think I got rid of every single one of them. I do have some eggs that we can transfer as well which we will do because like, I don't know how the egg situation is gonna work in the new game and it would be kind of interesting to see. Okay, well, oh, you can refill. <laughs> you can do it, you can refill it. Of course it would be pay to win, bro. Of course it would be pay to win. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Are you freaking? Oh my god! Oh my god! That's hilarious. Okay, all right. So there's a there's a week cooldown, or if you want, you can pay to win and just transfer it. That is hilarious. Okay, all right. Let's transfer these eggs. There we go. We got six, and now it should show. Yeah, that we've done six, and we got uh, 
eight left. There we go. Okay, so like I said, I don't think I have any exclusive pets. Uh, I lied, I do. Okay, let's do this. Can we do our hippo melons? I got a bunch of hippo melons. You know, we'll make Koi List happy. We'll transfer every single one of these hippo melons. I think it was 10, maybe it was 14. I think it was 10 though. Was it 14 eggs? I think it was 10, yeah, it was 10. Ah, oh, the hippo melons don't transfer. Ah, uh, Koi List, I'm sorry, bro. <laughs> something tells me that probably will change okay all right so it looks like the pets you got for free like all the uh all the event pets that were exclusive and then kind of randomly turned to event those do not transfer it has to be the pay to win things uh, if you paid to if you paid for a pet with robux that bro that thing will go either robux or real money <laughs> that's what transfers not the uh not the hippo melons okay all right there we go we've done it we've done it this is our history wait why does it say oh okay okay so like if i go to my inventory now <laughs> yeah there we go it says it's been transferred okay interesting we've learned things today night fox would you be able, interested in a trading season one epic gift and 75 billion for a cosmic axolotl it's your dream pet uh, I'll just give you a cosmic axolotl. I don't really need all that. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Let's see. Juan, drop your, uh, drop your username in the comments. I'll see if I can mail it to you. We'll do some, we'll do some mailing of some pets. I think that's what we'll do with the last little bit of the stream. There isn't really anything new. There is some really cool, interesting things that are happening. Let me know your thoughts on the matter. Let me know your thoughts on everything. And, uh, you know, we'll, we'll check it out when the new update comes. We definitely got a lot of things to do including uh a lot of pay to win <laughs> Transferring i don't know man i'm not really sure what i want to do just yet nick has all the new pets i was looking for okay anyway <laughs>